What's up? I'm the college Jew. Welcome back to Let's Play Final uh yeah, Final Fantasy 4. Uh welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Warrior 4. Uh I'm just finishing up the uh what do you call it? Uh Dark Great Lighthouse, whatever it is. Um because it didn't last time, I just got my ass whooped. But yeah, like <clears throat> So That's about it. I mean like any, like anyway, like at any level, these guys are gonna be really hard because you don't have that many, you don't have the upgrades necessary to make these enemies really easy. Like I see another guy do this at like level like 17, 18, and he didn't have as many problems as me, but I still think it was, I still think that this is one of these uh, fights where. No matter how much you level up, you're just gonna have a tough time anyway. Because Hector doesn't, uh, level up with you, because he's just an NPC. So... And Nera's not gonna get, get that much HP. Uh, Mera might learn some new attacks, but they're all fire-based anyway, so... There's <laughs> not much you can do against the Flamers. Against the Lighthouse Bengal, I guess maybe the hero gets some more strength and... Uh, speed and defense power, but <clears throat> it's not worth the time. It's not worth the grinding because when you get everyone else from all the other chapters, they're going to be severely under leveled compared to you, and you don't really want that because the the, the game's later bosses are going to basically demand that you all have the same level because they will go after an under leveled guy and just beat the shit out of him, so... That's why I'm preaching, like, keep everyone at the same level. It just makes the game a lot smoother. Like, the DS version... <clears throat> uh, allows you to accomplish this so much better because you don't have these stupid strategies that hardly ever work. I mean, only ones that work are what? Offensive and use no MP? All the others are bullshit, I mean, you, you select defensive and Nara's gonna try to put the enemy to sleep, which hardly ever works. Uh, Mara will, might cast Sap, but usually doesn't. And, no, I mean, in, in the, I'll tell you one thing, in the DS version, I was at level, like, 10, and I, like, completely owned the shit out of these guys. That's because everyone can learn, uh, that's because everyone can, uh, follow orders. Which is it's necessary almost. But anyway, we're done. We get the fire serenity. Let me heal up first. I mean, I'm going right back to a an ender, but you know. Awesome fire graphic. <laughs> Gotta love the NES. Awesome, cool, okay. I think there's still enemies in this place, but like the encounter rate's a lot less. Now you can feel free to get all the treasures that uh, <clears throat> you encountered. Uh, Cause now the encounter rate in here is so much less, but uh, I'll see you at Conember. Alright, we're here, we are in Conenver. And we're ready, we're ready to get the uh, ship now because the lighthouse is free of monsters. The reason why it makes no sense is because there's monsters on the, <laughs> in the water. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Oh, and the sea is so calm now. Oh, I guess it was affecting the sea. I forgot all about that. No! I want I want you to be on our party, Taloon. I hate Taloon. He's the worst character in the game. 
Average hit points. Average strength. No, it's not starboard the helm. It's, I'm on a boat. I'm on a boat. Take a good hard look at the motherfucking boat. <laughs> I love that song. That whole record I heard was really good from the Lonely Island. Now you want to go, the first place you really want to go is uh, south. <clears throat> and let me try and find it first. Oh! Oh, it's our first enemy in the ocean. Banglers. These, these enemies are a piece of cake. They cast around, but... Like, they're pretty weak against fire magic, so you can take them out pretty easily. They don't do that much damage as, they, as you see right there. They have about 50 HP. And they're not that horrible. The enemies in the sea, in general, are pretty easy. But yeah, here's Mentos. Uh, Mentos. They sell Mentos. <laughs> no, I think I'm going to call this episode, I'm on a boat, because it's, it's, that's just epic. We're on a boat. I'm on a boat, motherfucker, take a look at me. Straight. Oh, I don't remember the words. But anyway. Remember all the uh, Sword of Malice I bought in Chapter 3? <clears throat> We're gonna put them to good use, but uh, get, yeah, get the Sword of Malice for your hero. Uh, Iron Helmet. Iron Shield. If we don't have it already. And the full play armor for your hero. And some good upgrades right there. Oh, that's money. Mmm. That's gonna be a good, like, probably $12,000 we can spend right there, so, uh, yeah. But give one to your hero, obviously. It was good, because it casts Fireball. I know it's only a little bit stronger than the Broadsword, but, eh. It's good for the Fireball spell when used as an item. That about does it for this episode of Let's Play uh, Dragon Warrior 4. Peace.